Hey everybody, so when I typed in how much wildlife has been killed off, have been killed off um, in the last 70 years, the first thing that pops up is, according to the World Wildlife Fund's WWF 2022 Living Planet Report, the average global population of vertebrates, mammals, birds, amphibians, reptiles, and fish has declined by 69% since 1970. Freshwater species declined by 83% on average. Okay, a lot of that has to do with the plastic in the fucking oceans, dude, and the trash. I'm just being, fuck. Latin America and the Caribbean declined by 94% on average. All you rich people love the oceans, yet you guys can't take care of them. <clears throat> I'm just, I'm giving you guys this as a chance, this pain. I'm hoping it causes you pain so you change your fucking ways. Because you guys, you're, you have the power to change this shit, and you're choosing not to. Most people, like myself, really don't have much other than a voice to do and to work on you know, projects like I'm working on. But you guys have the power right now with your influence and with your money and with your connections to really make significant changes on this planet for future generations and for goodness sake. And I'm hoping you do. So I'm going to continue giving you this information because this is what's really fucking happening. Habitat destruction, the biggest cause of wildlife loss. <clears throat> Yeah, taking away the, the fucking trees, okay? Yeah, you take down native trees to a native area that have been used for who knows how long by these animals as their homes, and then it kills them because they have no fucking home. Just like if you were to take an Eskimo out of his home in the middle of Alaska, he's going to freeze to death. Or any type of animal taking away its shelter, they're li likely going to die or be fucking damaged and eventually killed. I mean, if they have nowhere to sustain themselves and to feed and to, to, to rest and defend themselves against predators, they're fucking dead. You know, if you're in, if you're in an, a fertile, in a, like when you think about an animal, like they're surrounded by enemies all the time. So like their home, their shelter, their nest, their tree, their, their safe sanctuary point is like everything to them. Without that, they're, they're fucking might as well be dead because they have no safe place to hide from predators. And it's just, think about the, the millions, if not billions of creatures that have died because we've chosen to go in there and clear out fucking land to produce more fucking products that we don't have to. <clears throat> like, that all has an effect on us, dude. I know you don't want to hear it, but it's the fucking truth. And they don't want you knowing about this shit because we are bringing bad karma onto us. Therefore, it's lowering the collective vibration of humanity. The more of this shit we put out there, the lower we are. That's why they don't want you to know about the hemp plant. It is what it is. So, all right, global trade, a contributing factor. Yeah, poaching, all that type of shit's got to stop. <clears throat> Innovative species. Yeah, as I've said, it's a big factor. Disease, a big factor. And plastic helps spread disease. So, the more, the more plastic out there, the more disease, the more sickness, the less land, the less fertile soil. Just in hemp counters all that shit. <clears throat> So yeah, man, it's a big deal. Nature is literally disappearing. The average size of wildlife populations has fallen by a staggering 73%. The last, the latest edition of the Living Planet Report, which measures the average change in population sizes of more than 5,000 vertebrate species, shows a decline of 73% between 1970 and 2020. All right, I love you guys. I'll take care. Bye.